We're getting reports of the quake being felt everywhere from the San Juan Islands all the way to King County. There are so far no significant reports of damage. However, the quake certainly did get a lot of people's attention. 1068. Thank you. Thanks for coming by. The day started very early for the crew at Dad's Diner in Anacortes. Jamie Miller was getting ready for work when it hit. My dog started freaking out, <laughs> being a little spaz. And so then I um, started to realize that everything in my house was shaking. <laughs> yeah. Jamie immediately ran for the cover of a door jam, just like she learned in school years ago. It was like muscle memory. <laughs> getting under a, a desk or a door jam. My dog alerted me. I thought there was somebody at the front door. And then I thought that person was flying a jet airplane into our house. Damage from the quake was minimal, but it was strong enough to move Davina Liberty's Orcas Island barn a few inches off its foundation. Orcas was the epicenter for the quake. A smaller aftershock of 1.3 hit a few minutes later closer to Anacortes, sparking fears of a potential tsunami, but one never developed. This is the epicenter right here where the star is. Harold Tobin is Washington State's seismologist and director of the Pacific Northwest Seismic Network. The network is continuously monitoring earthquake activity. Activity. Tobin says today's earthquake and other recent activity are nothing to be alarmed about. Right now what we're seeing is certainly more activity than is just typical in a week, but not anything that is really unusual or out of our past experience of earthquakes in our region. But Tobin says in the Northwest, we must never get complacent. They don't happen very often, thankfully, the damaging ones, but when they come, they come really when you least expect it, without warning. We're told people in the San Juans can expect aftershocks for the next several weeks. Emergency responders tell us this is a great time to make sure you have a disaster plan for your family and home. In Anacortes, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.